welcome back to another episode on the Kamicraft server. I'm uh, in the Christmas village, as promised. Gonna work on the tree. But I wanted to show off some other stuff first, because we got a nice big candy cane over there. We got a gingerbread house village that popped up. It looks amazing. And of course it's it's made by Freddy. I love this. It's such a nice uh, ambience to it. Real Christmassy. Gets me into the spirit, at least. We got a big Santa sled going down. Bunch of stuff happening. So, as promised, I did preparations. Got a bunch of wood. Um, I got a bunch of spruce leaves. We're gonna build the tree. And I already did a bit of looking around. Actually, did I want to count this? Probably do. Did some looking around for uh, different types of trees. And I'm not going to do a too big one. Yeah, this, this seems fine. Let's have a look. Yeah, I think that'll that'll be fine. Gets a bit taller. The leaves will go higher than, than the trunk will. Alright, let, let's size it up a bit. Because this is way too small. You know what? I'll, I'll build the trunk and then... And we'll get back for the tree. Or I'll do the whole tree. We'll see how quick things go. Yeah, I mean... Got a sort of rough shape going down with the with the trunks. Or the trunk. Yeah, the big tree trunk. And if it doesn't work out too well... I, I have no idea how this is going to work out. I just thought... I'll make like a... Great, it's turning dark. I'll make like a cone-shaped center and uh, I mean if it doesn't work out well at least it'll burn well which uh, I think is always a bonus go on let me sleep there we go so the next step I guess is to go and add leaves to to this tree don't think I got enough, but we'll see how far we get. Let's start a bit low. Alright, I got a bottom layer in place. And it's it's a nice circle, which which I'll break up later, but it's just to get a get a base for what it's gonna look like. And on top of this I'll, I'll start piling some more leaves. But first I might have to figure out a bit of the shape. So I'm gonna, gonna try that a bit. Cause we gotta end up in the middle over there. So let's, let's just go up a bit. See how that turns out. See how this looks. I mean, it's probably really bad, but obviously, it's just to get like a shape. Now we'll break it up a bit. Let's get this XP. Ooh. I think that worked out really well. Yeah, alright. So, um, I'm gonna do this on all four sides, I guess. Get it somewhat the same, and then we'll start filling it up in layers. I think that should work out. At least I hope so. There. Things are things are taking shape. I mean it's still it looks weird and if I'm gonna do it really clean it, it's gonna be weird as well. But no worries, we'll we'll clean that all 
up nicely. My next step is to... Let's see. Make all these corners into nice circles. Yeah, I think that's how I'm going to do it. I'm going to make all these corners uh, into their nice, perfect circles. And then that'll give us some room to work in. Yeah, let's see how that goes. I, I don't know. I'm just messing around, really. Pretending like I know what I'm doing. I mean, it's still going in the right direction. Every step I take seems to be uh, seems to be one in the right direction. The next step I wanted to do is just fill all these walls. Yeah, I'm just gonna make make. I'm gonna call them walls, and I'm gonna just fill them in like straight down like this. It's just gonna be a, a boring task, but. I think if I do that all the way around, I'll get a a nice shape, and it'll be not transparent. Now you can see that I, sometimes it's a bit not as visible as I'd hope to be because of the transparency. Hopefully that'll go away when I really dark again when I do all those walls. Just make it a bit more uh, visible to shape. And then once I got these walls in, like these neat walls, I'm just gonna tear out blocks and play some extra and make it real rough. So I filled in my walls and I started going around doing just a bit random. Like that. I hope to get a nice shape this way but it's not really turning out the way I hoped. That's, yeah, oh man. See, I don't want to rebuild the tree, but I think mm. I think the way I tried to do it by building that shape first might might have been a bad idea. Although some parts of what I did here I like, so maybe I can go around, keep doing it, and fix it that way. I'm gonna try it. This new att attempt is definitely working out better than than the last one. Find a different way of doing it. It's it's tedious, but it works out apparently, which I like. Yeah, this is definitely better looking than before. Before it, oh, before it kept kept looking a bit square, and now, now it's a lot more organic and rounded, which I like. I think it should be that way. Quickly show a bit of how. Oh, doing it at the moment. Not by falling down, obviously. Let's see if I can get up there. There we go. And there. Let's get some leaves. start going around so it's just yeah just going around a bit trying to keep I don't know sometimes pop one out so it's not too too flat everywhere I mean, this is this is like the last part, so it's it's a lot easier already, I guess. Just keep going around, and then we go down. We have a look, and this is still looking all right. Yeah. I've already got to the part where I'm slowly making a tip to finish off the tree, but I'm liking how this is working out. I'll just keep continuing this for a while. Oh, this this needs a bit something. I don't know. There. I don't know. I'm just 
sort of trying her out, seeing what feels right. There's no real trick to it, it's just looking and everything that doesn't look like it should, you, you continue. Like for example over there, you get like a sort of, it's hard to see I guess, but you get a quite straight corner. Right over there, with one one little block out of the corner, but that'll fix itself with the next layer, which is kind of cool. And if not, I'll go up there and just place a few blocks or remove. Just keep playing around. This is exactly what I wanted. Nice, got it, got it done. Tree's done. Well, the the tree is, but I'm gonna decorate it a bit. I'll not fully decorate it so other people get the chance to We don't want you here. So other people get the chance to decorate it a bit. Go away. And uh Yeah. But as I was thinking or as I was building that, I thought maybe with um with clay terracotta I could make like a nice uh garland going around it. I'm not sure if that would work out or not, but Seems like something I could try. So I'm gonna grab some clay terracotta and uh, see how all that works out. Well, I uh, started building the tree. I was building the tree. I know Dits has been building a Santa hut near. And uh, occasionally, because there's some pumpkins like growing behind that hut over there. And occasionally. I went and grabbed some pumpkins and uh, placed a few snowmen in here. <laughs> so yet again, I have a few pumpkins. I got three of them. I went into this this hut and I put a few snowmen. <laughs> Took their helmets off. We're slowly just filling this hut up. Let's see how far we get, because I'm assuming that's all log on within. In uh, one or two hours now. <laughs> Let's see how he reacts to that. That's just logged on. And he's inside the Santa hat, which is absolutely perfect. Uh, <laughs> that's the reaction I was hoping for. I love these decorations, especially those balls. Did some ribbons around it, put some balls up there. And the snow definitely, I like the snow on the on the tree, helps out a lot. I did a bunch of it off camera, cause, well I kind of did all of it off camera. Because these, these things, they cost so much gummy coins and I needed so many to, to fill the whole tree up. But I do think it adds like a real, real nice... Uh, decoration to it. I love it. Yeah, I love how it turns out. I also uh, put down two snow elves or Christmas elves with a bunch of packages around them or presents. I think that could be fun. If you woke up, it gets a bit festive. I like that. And next thing I kind of want to do, which I think will get it close to finishing, I think I might, might leave the lights. Maybe someone else will do that or something. I don't know. I haven't decided yet, but I'll add a, I think I'll add a star on top of it, because I think that, you know, Christmas tree needs a topper. I think a star will do nice. I'm gonna mess around with that a bit, see how that all works out. I got some snow blocks, so I can uh, play around with shapes. Alright, this is what I came up with. It's not gonna stay white, this is just to, to play around with the shape. But... It's about the smallest uh, I could get it and still be a nice shape, like a sort of a star shape. And it's also not too big to, uh, well, it's just not too big, it, it sort of matches the tree. It's, it's on the big side, but it's not, it's alright. And uh, I thought it could be cool to make this sort of in a 3D star as well, but I'll do that when I get some... Uh, some different blocks. I'll go go and grab some, some blocks. I'm thinking gold because they're shiny. 
I have no idea if I got enough, so I gotta check that out. And else I gotta. It's not in there. And if not, oh, I'm gonna have to. Well, it'll get me somewhere. I might have to go and get more. So I'll get. Uh, I'll get that shape into gold. And then. We'll see if I need to get more and make it 3D and stuff. Yeah, I'm definitely liking the gold. I like that. Now it's just time to get it in 3D and then definitely get some lights in there and we'll see if I can swap out some blocks for, I don't know, wool or concrete. Get some block variety in there. Let's get this 3D first. This didn't really work out. It's a bit weird, isn't it? I think I gotta get rid of these, uh, what, rounded off corners? Just keep it flat. I don't know, but I'm gonna change it because I don't like how orby it is. Yeah, I like this. I like this better. This is better star shape. The, more, the one before was just sort of an orb. I did try and replace that corner block, that extra one, the one my cursor was on, with a what is it, redstone lamp. But that was uh, that was a really bad idea. <laughs> it looked horrible. But I thought maybe I could do with end rods and uh, what is it? Stick, stick them out on the edges and stuff. See if that helps and light them up a bit. I think it might look cool. Yeah, this this is alright. The the end rods by themselves look horrible. But I added some, some glass panes. To add a bit of, I don't know. Wash over it, I guess. I think it looks alright. Let's get over bit further away. Yeah, I think that looks alright. I don't know how much it lights it up, but it should be should be quite decent. I got, got an end rod on all ends. They should should give off a nice glow. Lights are pretty well I would say. I like that. That's really bright. Also the, the, what is it, that villager was selling uh, candles, and I thought if I put a candle in there, and then an end rod behind it, it could kind of look, look nice. The candle doesn't stand out that much, but I do like the end rod, they, they don't stand out as much either, so it, it gives off a bit of light, and it, I think the tree needs a bit of light. So I'm gonna, gonna go around, run a bit, and place a bunch of those uh, candles with end rods. See how that works out. Oh yeah, I like how this worked out. I mean the candles and the, and the end rods work, work alright. It's not perfect, but it's pretty good I think. I like the little, the little candle thingies. Let's go a bit further out and watch it in, in its full glory. Not too far though, because I noticed if you walk away too far the, the, the heads will disappear. Let's see if we can find the, uh, oh, that, that is slowly going. Yeah, no more heads. And then we walk closer, and then they pop up again. <laughs> I think it looks alright from here. Pretty cool. So I guess, I guess the tree is done. I mean, ooh, perfect, get some snow. Well, I don't know if it's that perfect, it'll ruin your view maybe a bit. But I like how this tree turned out. It's not, I mean, it, it can use more decoration, or there's room for more decoration. So if people want to, they, they, they can decorate a bit more. That, that's why I didn't fill it up completely. And if not, I mean, it's it's still nicely decorated, I think. And maybe I'll add a bit, bits and stuff a bit later on as well. Just slowly, here and there, once in a while. Or not, I don't know. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna call this tree done for, for now. I just I'm gonna call it done and to finish off I am going to put my name in the secret Santa because that's build a cool hut for that and I think that's always fun the, the secret Santa thingy so I'm gonna gonna read the example book for a bit well actually I already did it 
And it basically says like, you know, don't don't ask for a ridiculous amount of stuff. Just have fun with it. It's just I mean the whole thing is just meant for fun, so you don't wanna wanna be annoying of asking like a stack of diamond blocks or something. Which I don't need anyway, because I got that. Uh so I gotta think of a few fun things to ask. Because, I mean, I'm fairly fairly set up with stuff. So I gotta think of something fun. Uh, so I'm gonna do that for a bit and then come back to you when I uh, thought of thought of anything. Alright, I, th I thought of some items to... Uh, or some items. I thought of some things to put on my wish list. So I'm gonna, gonna fill in a book. Bankard Apple. Which I'm, I'm currently not able to write, apparently. There we go. Wishes for... Flowers. All kinds of... Uh, all kinds of flowers. For decorating... Because I don't have that many just flowers to decorate areas and such. I always keep forgetting to, to collect that. So I think that's a good good thing to ask for. I like that. Glowstone? Always. I'm, I'm, I don't have much glowstone. And I'm too lazy to, to gather that as well. Could use that. And, and golden carrots. Because I always have to buy those a lot. And they, and they go through them so quick. I think I think that's that's like three options. Anything you think of? Well, I don't really need to add that. You know, own inputs fine as well. You don't have to follow my list. There we go. Let's. Oh, I probably should sign it. Sign. Book title. I'm oh, just. Do my own name, I guess. There we go. Yeah, that's... Oh, pressing all the wrong buttons. There we go. Is this, is this like... Yeah, it's gone. Well, we got the tree done, as promised, finally. Put my name in the center. I'd say that's a pretty successful... Uh, Successful week. I enjoyed building the Christmas tree. I'm happy it's it up now. It took a bit of effort, but it'll it'll help get this uh, Christmas village uh, into the right mood. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing it. I tried to show a bit of the process, although it's it's hard. I think. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. I did, and uh, see you next time.